thank you for your patience. So I have prepared four different dishes using amaranth. Um, as I told you, each one is made with one quarter cup of amaranth um, but once it was popped. First I'm going to show you again what one fourth cup of amaranth looks like. And here I have it, one fourth cup, and this is what it looks like. And once I popped it, it looks like this. So I have here one fourth cup of popped amaranth. This is what I have used to prepare all these dishes. Um, let me start with dish number one, which is kheer or porridge. I love this. I have used the same amount of amaranth here and two cups of milk. I've also added about five walnuts in it. I love the crunch. There is no added sugar to it, but if you would like, you can add Splenda or uh, any other sweetener that you do use. Just to give you an estimate, this big bowl has about 500 calories and 44 grams of carbohydrate and about 23 grams of protein. So it's a very high protein um, uh, breakfast. And this will keep you satisfied for a long, long time. There's quite a bit of it. It's hard for me to eat all of it at one time. Uh, let's move on to my next dish, um, where I have used vegetables. I have used different kind of peppers in it, or four different kinds of peppers, and you can tell the color. The more color, the better it is. And uh, same amount of amaranth. I usually eat this with yogurt. And depending on what kind of yogurt you have, you can have it really extremely high protein. In this one, this is homemade regular yogurt. And in this one, I have about 52 grams of carbohydrate and 27 grams of protein with about 500 calories. If you like to use any of Greek yogurts, like phage or phage, that's called, uh, you can in increase the protein content of the same meal. Now my third meal, which I also called on the go, um, this is right here, it's again using the same amount of one fourth um, cup of amaranth popped. What I do is, if I'm running, I just put this in a little baggie and I add these one eighth cup of nuts to it and I add one cup of this already made seasoning which is with um, hot peppers and some oil. All you have to do is add your yogurt to it. You can add fudge yogurt to make it high protein or you can add regular yogurt. I've taken one cup of regular yogurt and added some water to it because I like it a little thinner. You can also add some milk to it if you like. And here, let me show you. This is, this is my on the go. Let me just put it in a different bowl here. It's easier to manage it. So this becomes on-the-go breakfast and this is also quite satisfying and keeps you going for quite some time. Here I have it. This is another one and this is also again about 500 calories and 43 grams of carbohydrate and 33 grams of protein. Now my last breakfast here is the laddus that I have made using amaranth and um, almonds. I will not be eating all these laddus at one time, but I usually have two or three laddus with one glass of milk. Again, this depending on the milk you are using um, and how many laddus you are having, you have about uh, this milk, in this milk about 16 grams of carbohydrate and 12 grams of protein. This meal is high in uh, protein and uh, calories but not as high in carbohydrates because there are not too many carbohydrates used. So enjoy all these amaranth uh, breakfast. Until we meet again, this is Bhavan.